Hi, so here we have a problem which was sent by Mr. Nelly Max from Nigeria and in this problem we have to find the last digit of 1032 to the power 1032. So am I going to multiply 1032 times? No. What I'm going to do is I will focus only on the last digit and while doing so I'll observe the behavior of the last digit. So last digit over here is 2. So 2 to the power 0 is 1, 2 to the power 1 is 2, 2 to the power 2 is 4 and 2 to the power 3 is 8 and 2 to the power 4 is 16 and 2 to the power 5 is 32 and here we get 2 again as the units place digit right so this is the behavior of 2 and if I write the behavior of 4 4 to the power 2 is 16 8 to the power 2 is 64 and here we have 6 at the units place so I'll just talk about 6 and 6 to the power 2 is 36 so that means if you have a number with 6 at units place and then you raise it to the any power the units place will always remain 6 because 6 multiplied by 6 will always give you 6 at units place and that is what I am going to use while solving this problem so 1032 to the power 4 will have 6 at at units place because 2 to the power 4 gives you 16 which has 6 at units place so 1032 to the power 4 will always have 6 at units place and this 1032 whole to the power 1032 can actually be written as 1032 whole to the power 4 and this whole to the power 258 258 when multiplied by 4 you get 1032 so 1032 to the power 1032 can be written as 1032 whole to the power 4 and this again raised to the power of 258 so since this much expression has units place as 6 that means this whole expression will also have units place as 6 so this will also have 6 at its place right so it was a very simple solution and if you also have any problem for which you need a solution you can send your problems to the number shown in the screen and for many more interesting videos keep watching MathSmart subscribe to it and don't forget to press the notification bell because then only you will get to know about my new upcoming videos so bye bye till then